And here there's an axolotl in the building. You ever kind of an axolotl? Uh, no, sir. They're really cool. So you know why I like axolotls? Why? The axolotl courses. <laughs> <laughs> that was a good one. That's one bad. Today, I'm here with my axolotl, Monty. When I found out about axolotls, I was like, uh, one, this looks like a Pokemon, and two, it's very unique. He never goes through metamorphosis, and so he spends his whole life as a child. Hey, hey, what's going on, man? Hey, not too much. How you been? Doing good. I got Monty with me here today. I've had him for about two years now, and he hadn't eaten in six weeks. Woo, boy. Because Monty's a salamander, it's normal for him to go a few days between meals. But in this case, he hasn't eaten in quite a while. I'm pretty stressed out. I have asked everyone in the state of Georgia pretty much to take a look at him. It's pretty concerning that there's nobody that can help me out with an exotic pet like this. And so it was a huge relief to know that there was a, a doc here willing to take a look. We'll take him back and kind of examine him, maybe get an x-ray and check some stuff out. An axolotl is a type of salamander that lives his entire life underwater and in the wild. They live in a single lake in Mexico City. You need some help carrying that thing? No, oh, no, I doubt it. I can't imagine he's that heavy. We'll come grab you in a second. I appreciate it. Thank All you. All right. You don't see many axolotls, but axolotls are really cute. I can tell you this. We didn't see a lot of them in vet school. I'm not saying I'm an axolotl expert. However, you know, in my 20 year career, I maybe I've treated maybe six or seven. Hey, bud. Cool looking thing. I don't like this restoration, and I don't like the way these gills look. This ain't a lot of it, huh? Just looking at the, the gills, they should be nice, fiery red. I can notice they're, they're a little blanched. And also, I saw like a little gunk on top of them that definitely shouldn't be there. We're gonna take an x ray and see how he does. You poor little guy. All right, buddy. Looking at Monty, respiration rate, I just don't like the shallow breathing. I think I want to shoot an x-ray just so I can see what's going on on the inside. All right, what we got here? Buddy got some infection there. Looking at his lung, we might have a little axolotl pneumonia. I guess we'll bring the owner in and talk to him. Poor little guy. Oftentimes, when animals, dogs, cats, or even people, when you feel really bad and you have a hard time breathing, the last thing in the world you want to do is try to eat something. So after a while, you don't get the normal nutrition and everything to make the body go. And unfortunately, you know, it can lead to death. This is what the inside of your axolotl looks like, boss. All right. Definitely seems like we have an infection going on. Mm -hmm. So we're going to give him a drug called enrofloxacillin, which should eliminate any bacteria in those lungs, get him breathing freely again, and hopefully we're going to see if we can get him back eating some worms. All right, sweet. All right, man, I'll be back in there in a second. Appreciate it, thank Appreciate you. Appreciate you. So we're going to send them home with antibiotics for the next five days to hopefully clear up this really bad infection. And I feel like we'll have Monty up and eating some worms in no time. Monty's really a cool character. Tell me a little bit about his tank. He's in about a 55-gallon tank. The water is chilled to about 62 degrees. He's a father as well. He's got a son. Do they ever fight? They've gotten along pretty well together. Hopefully we can get this guy eating, man. Just administer for me. The enrofloxacillin over the next five days. Okay. Dr. Hodges was a really good vet. Dr. Hodges knew exactly how to treat him, and I'm pretty hopeful for Monty. I'm, I'm hoping that he'll go back to his, his normal, chubby, thick self. I appreciate right, it, man. sir. Thank Thanks you. so much, man. I'll see you in about a week. Absolutely. Bye, brother.